Welcome all to what is the first of the group stage fixtures of the Europa League. So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury and it's a pleasure to be alongside Jim Beglin. Thanks for that, Peter, and may I say a big hello to everyone. So the central characters bask in the pre-match atmosphere as the anthem rings out. Quick look at the lineups. We're underway. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? The Chilean Arturo Vidal. He has tremendous heart and desire about his game, but what I like best about him is his aggression. Every run, pass and tackle seems to mean a bit more to, uh, to winners like him. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Fires it in low. Well, when the options aren't quite present in the box, it's the crosser's interest to uh, to hold on for the support. And it's Vidal. Speculative strike. And the keeper's relieved to see that disappear wide. And that was more than a decent attempt. Perhaps it deserved better, too. Well, I think the early signs have been very good for them. They've already got that defence unsettled, and... Now they've got to back it up. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. And he's there to hoof it away. Xavi Alonso. Brought forward. What does he try from here? Good running with the ball, can they build on it? Looks like a good ball through, and he's there to cut it out. Xavi Alonso. Alarm. Some good work on the right flank, now what's next? It's a good-looking cross, and out to safety. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Jerome RZ have a free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. I wasn't expecting him to try his look from so far out, but that was close. I mean, it kept the keeper on his toes. Spoon forward.
Well, he had the chance to, to release it left and ended up making the wrong choice by, by going it alone. He just took on way too many there, and he's got to think about that a little bit more and, and make a better decision. Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. Yeah, and that was all about the through ball. Great control, and the weight was perfect. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Keeper's got good distance on that. Gets it back. Thiago. Done very well to intervene. Looks to slip it through. Get a throw in. Who's going to make this theirs? Tries a through ball. Oh, good interception. Tries the route one option. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Muller. Now the pass. Timely intervention. Fence has got rid of that. Passes it through. Away from immediate danger. Gets it upfield. Ribery looks to slip it through. Hits it first time! He's done very well to get to that. Keeper has shown great concentration there. I think his anticipation pretty much did the trick for him. Muller. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Oh, he's made sure that that won't get through. Vital. Big chance! And that's it for the first half. A breathless ending. So we reached the halfway point. Munich ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. And we're underway again. Munich can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Now the pass. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. but not by that far. Well, if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. They've come out of the dressing room firing on all cylinders now. We could be in for quite a second half here. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Pulls out on the left now. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Xavi Alonso. And it's Thiago. There's the cross. Pumps it upfield.
Thiago. Battles to win it back. And they are working very hard to get it. What? Mats Hummels. With a definite foul there. Looks like a good ball through. Now it's Vidal. Vidal could try cutting inside here. And in it goes. Just to pick me up the whole game needs. Oh, the cross was inch perfect, and the header unerring. Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met. It really was. Munich themselves into the lead look he's the one everyone expects to put the ball in the net that's what he's paid to do to get it away is it in and that's caused a worry or two well he has a bit of a reputation from that sort of range peter and he can't half smack one Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. RZ are keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Out to the left it goes. Vidal. Roman! Just swings wide. Well, I think the keeper knows all too well that there was no getting anywhere near that. That's a big escape. What are you thinking? Yeah, the ride is still a bit bumpy, Peter, so they're chasing the cushion of a second goal. Coaxed out to the wing. Hits one! Alaba tries to get it forward quickly. Xavi Alonso. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Well, they know he's the root of potential problems, Peter, and they seem intent on uprooting that problem, like that. Tries a long pass towards the front. Vidal... Gets his head to it! Oh, and that should have been two. Oh, it should have been the clincher, Peter, and he'll be kicking himself for not taking the pressure off. No surprise at all that this is the guy who's had such a positive impact. Well, not only can a player of such high calibre show the imagination to set up a goal, but he can also produce when the pressure's on to deliver a big moment. This guy was born to create. And it's Douglas Costa. Douglas Costa crosses in a low one. 
He's dealt with that well. Tries a through ball. He's found his man. And he's been booked for simulation. Well, that's just very cynical. For him to think he could get away with it is, uh, is ugly on his part. Is it out of harm's way? Vital. Now the pass. Well, that's not the cross he had in mind. It's Muller! And that would have been game, set and match. He put on quite a show there. He's been a joy to watch and, and that didn't miss by much. He'll be back. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Passes it through. Shoots! In he goes again! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Oh, he made that look really easy, Peter, but I can assure you that wasn't a, a routine save. He had to be very switched on there. He's away! You can get that clear. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Jerome Boateng pumps it forwards. What a throw in. Towering header! Danger averted for now. Mats Hummels. Jerome Boateng, Alarm. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Looks like a good ball through. Whistle's gone, and they've got themselves a free kick. Well, some of them are letting their emotions get the better of them. They don't want to inflame this any further. find its target how about it well when it becomes that speculative I think it requires something from the very there is the final whistle Munich start as they wanted to start all three points the first three points crucially any reflections on what you've seen Jim listen ideally any new campaign needs a start that puts three points on the board and its mission accomplished Nothing too fancy was required, just a, a good solid team display for me.